Vinay Smith, Michael Wilbon, Kendrick Perkins, I'm Malika Andrews. Paolo Bencaro getting his first taste of the postseason, whereas Donovan Mitchell is hoping to avenge uh, last year's loss to the New York Knicks for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Who needs to have a bigger series here, Stephen? A? Well, I think I think it's going to need to be uh, Van Caro, simply because I'm looking at Orlando, and they're going to need every bit of his offense as they can get. Both are big-time defensively, top 10 defensive teams. One is three, and Cleveland is seventh, respectively. But in the end, when you look at Cleveland, particularly with a Donovan Mitchell, who averaged about 27 in the three games he went up against uh, Orlando this year, and Cleveland shot better from three-point range, you surmise that with him, Garland, and others, they'll have some perimeter shooting. You don't know about that with Orlando. I think Van Caro is going to have to show his all-star stature, take advantage, and let's see what happens. Yeah, I'm with Stephen A. totally on this. With Garland and Mobley and Allen, Cleveland can create and cobble together enough offense if Donovan Mitchell, he can't be bad, but if he's off a little or takes a while to get going or has a bad game in that series, Ben Carroll's the one who's got to lead Orlando at this point. I, I, I think Orlando could win this series because I think Ben Carroll is up to this and for this and may be the best player in that series. I'm with you on that, but he's going to go through growing pains. I believe Ben Carroll has to elevate his game, but, you know, the playoffs is about adjustments. He's going to see di different schemes throwing at him. But Donovan Mitchell, all eyes are on him because yep. some believe that he has one foot out the door anyway right now. I want to see how committed he is to this organization and not just in this series throughout the remaining of this postseason. Be committed to the postseason. Don't worry about it.